it's all about perspective. In any kind of picture you make, the perspective is a key factor. Nature photography, wildlife, buildings, whatever. Even in bird photography, the perspective is a key factor to success. Hi, I'm Mario Killian. I'm living in central Germany. I have been taking pictures for more than 40 years. Now I will teach you all the secrets I learned from right to wrong, how to take the best pictures with your camera gear. Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time a big secret to get perfect bird photos is to use the right perspective. I mean the right angle where you're taking the pictures from the bird. What I mean exactly with this? Let's go out. I will show you. Once I started taking pictures of birds, I was really happy when I saw my first tits in the top of the tree sitting in a branch or the ducks in the water down in the lagoon. I take dozens of pictures or the falcon in the sky it was really, really amazing. I thought I got the best pictures I ever have took from birds, but my frustration was really big once I arrived at home and saw the pictures on the laptop. That was absolutely not good. From the tits, I only could see his belly. From the ducks, only his back. And the falcons in the sky, I, the background was really terrible. So I had to find out what is the real problem with this. And the problem was the perspective. And so I thought about it. And I found out that if I change the perspective and use the same technique I use to photograph buildings and landscapes, I will get much more better pictures of the birds. So what can I do? The first option and the easiest is to bring the camera down, as down as possible. And you can use the back panel to take the picture. It gives excellent results. If it is necessary, lie on the floor and take the picture. Don't worry so much about to get dirty because the photo, believe me, will reward it. Another option is to use the special tripods. In there you can attach the camera very down to the floor. It's very useful. If you're photographing birds in the water, maybe a more extreme solution is to get into the water and take the pictures. Believe me. The photos will be awesome. Another technique I usually use is to climb these hunting stands. This gives you a medium height and are perfect for shooting birds on a mid-range height. Another absolutely good option is to climb these observatory towers. From up there you can get the best pictures. Let's go up. Well, up from here, you have the best chance to get that falcon in flight, the birds on the top of the trees, and maybe to get some nest with newborn birds. It's cold and windy up here, but it's worth it. So, as we learned, the secret is to be aligned with the bird. The perspective 
is the key, like in any other kind of pictures. If you have any other secrets or know another techniques, write me in the comments so we can discuss it. If you find this video interesting, please, you may consider to subscribe, so you will not miss any other videos. And now, it's time to go out and go to take your best pictures. And now you can. See you. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better